Hello! I kind of got an interesting idea here. I found, I went through my old, old texts on Facebook all the way from back, from fucking damn, 2010, when I was in sixth grade. These were texts between me and somebody who was very, very interested in me in terms of a, a relationship. It wasn't reciprocal, which is probably why this person was interested in me, because I didn't have, because I just didn't give a fuck, it seemed. And I, I thought we could read through this, because it would be funny. Let's, um, let's get to it. Now I'm gonna blur this person and their, their name and their face and everything. So uh, yeah, for the sake of their own, you know, privacy. Let's see if we can learn anything from this. Add slash N, hmm, ah, mm, ah. <laughs> Just emojis. Finally, a Facebook. Now left is, is, is them, her, which now they're a he. Uh, yeah, no, that's not part of the point of the, that's not anything that has anything to do with this, but left is them, right is me. Lol slash N, hmm, ha, mm, uh, I'll try to be on this daily, ah. Uh, KK, I have Facebook, Facebook, mobile, mm, and, ha, mm, uh. <laughs> Same as John. It's a Fred, some guy that I knew. Lol slash N, hmm, ah, mm, uh. Lol, N, mm, ha, ah, uh. <laughs> Sixth graders, come on, you can't expect anything better. Ha ha, so sup, slash N, hmm, ha, mm, ah, uh. mm, nothing, just chillaxing, uh. Yeah. Sounds fun. Lol. I'm on me phone. Mm, slash N. Mm, uh, mm, uh. <laughs> you too? I need to get a phone. I'll be right back. Dinner. Then literally, uh, what was next time? A couple days later. June 19, 2010. Hey, what's up? Literally months later. I, I didn't reply to that. In October, they sent me a text. Months later. Hey, I broke up with Sean. Happy face. Then a few days after that, I said, okay, cool. Okay, now I wanna go out. I'm JW, okay. Okay, so we're going out like boyfriend and girlfriend? Yeah. Lol, okay, wait, you like me enough to go out with me, right? Like everyone can know that we are dating and you want would say that my girlfriend in point? Yeah, I would do that. I could see why they were interested in me. I didn't give a fuck. Like clearly young Jane didn't give a shit. <laughs> but also that was one thing that was a huge, like that, that really pulled me away from it. It's like, it was an identity to this person. They just wanted other people to see that we were together. That was more important to them. It was the ideas that came along with it, which is kind of gross, but you know, these are kids. But then again, don't forget, kids are just pre-adults. <laughs> the shit doesn't really get better as you get older. It, it just be seemingly becomes more articulate and more nuanced when in all reality, it's the same, just emotional ineptitude. So there's many reasons why I just don't respect human romance. Alrighty. Lol, okay, would you like to sit with me at lunch? Sometimes yes and sometimes no, because my friends won't really like me anymore if I sit anywhere else, but you're free to come sit with me. Yes, masculine frame. Don't let them move you, You move. they move to you. It's crazy, like, I was way better at this when I was younger, when I didn't have any interest in dating at this time, because I didn't really give a shit. I, I mean, I did, there were other people that I liked that I showed a little bit more attention to who didn't like me. But it's funny how the people who I didn't like, or saw that way, were interested in me and they were more interested as a result of my indifference towards them. That, like, that's fucking stupid. That's a joke. If you sit where I only at parts of a message you sent me, question mark? I'm on my phone, I can only get a certain amount of a message. Oh, I said sometimes because my friends don't like me anymore if I stay sitting there. Oh, they don't like me, do they? Yeah, they like you, but if I sit there all the time then, that's what happened to Landon, some other kid who was simping. Oh, okay, but I just wanted to know, do you like to put your arm around me and stuff like that and slow dance? I'm just wondering. Okay, it's the idea of all this stuff that's more important. Why, did you do that with Sean? Sean was a little too short to put his arm around me, lol. I was just wondering if you do that. If you don't, I'm okay with that. He was too short to put his arm around you while dancing? Is that one of the reasons why you broke up with him? <sighs> and people are just like, wow, Jaden, you, you just have these critical ideas towards romance. Like, yeah, because it's fucking mindless nonsense. What the hell is this? This is stupid. <laughs> these are kids. These are like people, these are at a time in people's lives where there's less of a, like, these are when the insecurities are really starting to manifest in people's life, right? Around sixth grade, you're growing up, you're starting to, to realize how stupid people are and, you, and you're starting to feel these random feelings. Before then, kids had just didn't have, had even less self-awareness and they didn't have that inkling of sexuality. It hadn't developed, so they weren't like, like fucking pushed down by that. Law, while this is my second date, I don't want to take it slow. I'm not that comfortable to put my arm around someone right now. Okay, cool with me. Okay then. Okay, I was just wondering if you did or didn't. I know. Okay, so what's up? Nothing, I'm gonna play some Xbox. <laughs> okay, lol. KK, lol. Lol. Yep. Yep. KK, lol. 
Yep. So, what you doing now, lol? Still playing, lol. It's a lot of fun. I'm also talking to my friends. <laughs> cool, lol. Yep. Yep. So, are you happy we're together? Wow. And then I just didn't reply. At least until later. Yeah, I'm also on my on Facebook, on my iPad, iPod. Oh my god, cool. Lol. iPod. Damn, really was 2010, huh? I'm only 26. That's not that old, but goddamn, time does move. It's, this, it's fucking terrifying. Lol, I'm on Facebook on my computer. Lol. Lol, I just got a question. What do you mean, take it slow? I'm just drawing a blank, lol. Can you tell me what you mean by slow, lol? I'm just wondering. And then I don't reply to that. Oh, wait, no, it's only later 20 minutes later. I would just ask you here, lol. Like, last time we went out and broke up because of rumors, will you break up with me if that happens again? Oh, and one more. Do you like me more than Kelsey? Because when I asked you last time, you just said, you said just as much as Kelsey. That's why I'm asking you, lol. Sorry for asking so many questions. I just had many breakups and had my heart broken many times. I just don't want that to happen, to you, happen you know what I mean? Yeah, Kelsey was a girl that um, I liked more than this person and was trying to get with. But of course, Kelsey didn't. Of course, you like stuff that you can't have because, you know, it's all mindless crap. Also, we broke up initially because I just wasn't feeling it. And, um... I didn't have any investment or interest. And I broke up with them at a dance, right? During the middle of it, like as a school party or something. And I didn't really, uh, yeah. This was just thrust upon me. I didn't have any like, <laughs> I was just reacting. My, my ADHD doped up brain. So yeah, then at eight. Yeah, I know what you mean. So yeah, I now do like you more than Kelsey now because well, I'm like invisible to her nowadays. Oh yeah, I do. <sighs> I like you more than I like you now because somebody else doesn't like me. Fuck, dude. Maybe that's why this person really liked me because I just didn't care that much. Cool, lol. And I like you more than anyone, lol. And are you into holding hands? I'm just wondering because I used to with boyfriends, but if you're not, it's okay. It was just a random question, lol. No response. The next day, hey. No response. And then the next day, I say, hey. Then they respond, what's up? No response for two days from me. Hey, lol, what's up? No response for four days from me. Sorry, but we need to break up. I'm sorry. Then the next day I say, oh, okay. Then they respond, okay, sorry. Sorry it didn't work out. We were not talking that much and I didn't know what you meant by slow. I hope we can still be friends. Message me back, bye. Then I respond, maybe. What, we can't be friends anymore? I never said that. That's not really the best reason to break up with me. Okay, then what do you mean maybe? BB plus SF equals heart? Okay, then what do you mean maybe? I mean to take it slow because that is like my second date. What does that mean, lol? Oh, BB plus FF equals heart, huh? Oh, oh. I don't know what that means. Never mind. Don't know what that means. What? Don't know what what means. Then I respond, nope. What are you talking about? I don't know what that th that thing you're saying means. BP plus FF equals heart. What am I saying? Where do you talk about my signature? Okay, you know we're not BF and girlfriend anymore, right? Oh, yep. And I responded, KK. And then I sent them a message. Ah, the next day. Lol, huh? Wow, this conversation is old. Oh, this was in 2011, the next year. Oh my god, I know, right, lol, forgot about it, lol, yep, yeah, haven't seen you in a while except today. I know, right, long time no see, lol, and haven't talked in like forever. Yeah, it's been a while. Haha, <laughs> yeah, like a few months at least, lol. I'm looking at the old messages from November. Lol, awkward, lol. Heh, what Scott said today was total crap. He got shot by a bullet. My ass. <laughs> He's a tool. <laughs> lol, I know, right, he don't got a tool. But not in a bad way. Because I was still interacting with this guy. His name is Scott. Lol. He's not a total douche. Lol. Not a total one, lol. So yeah, he's trying to impress you. Yep, lol. Not to sound stuck up, but a lot of guys do that. I know. I can do that too. Lol. What do you mean you can do that too? I act like a macho man sometimes when it comes to, I don't know, toughness, fighting. Yeah, no boy stuff. Lol. Oh yeah, I get you. Many guys do. It's no big deal. It's actually cute when they do, lol. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, and pathetic. Lol, wow, I need to listen to myself when I talk. Wow, I was, I had some degree of self-awareness. Maybe this was seventh grade or something. Lol, why? It's no big deal. Well, that's me. Lol, you calling yourself pathetic? All right, I'll catch you later. I'll head off to bed. See you later. Just drop everything, conversation. Lol, all right, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Lol, bye. Talk to you later. And yes, I'm calling myself pathetic. Lol, don't. You're nice and funny, not pathetic. Lol. Lol, all right, bye. Lol, bye. Thanks. No problem, lol. Then, when is this next one? Okay, so June... 17, 2011. Then they sent me a text. Hey, I don't respond until an hour later. Hello. Wait, I heard that you were moving and I'm getting a phone at the end of summer. I'm so excited. They responded, lol. Oh my God, you need to give me your number in this July. Ha ha. Hmm. Yep. When I get it. Blah. Okay, lol. So I heard that you're moving to South Carolina. 
Yep. Mm. Oh, damn. Well, bye. <laughs> huh? Bye? I'm not leaving yet. And so what's up? Haven't talked in a while-ish. Well, how's your summer? Then I respond the next day. Decent. It's an okay summer. Same here. I've had better. That was the last message that they sent at 1 a.m. on July 2nd, 2011. That was the first girlfriend that I've ever had. That was, that was dumb. <laughs> yes, I don't really respect dating because that's kind of where it starts. People's emotions are kind of just mindless nonsense. So um, what's the moral to be taken away from that? Don't take it seriously and people will like you more. If you don't have respect for women, if you just don't care about them, they will be fucking enamored by you, it seems. And it seems like in the, in the mind of a sixth grader, that's no different than in the mind of your average grown woman, at least in this part of the world. I don't know if it's the same in everywhere else, but yeah, you get the same dating bullshit advice from all sorts of uh, gurus online, right? Maintain your masculine frame, show them that you have options, make them feel like they're just an, a disposable. Great. What a great way to have a meaningful, substantial relationship. Humans are awesome, aren't we?